Hi, my beautiful Pisces. What's up, you guys? It's Jessica, and it's Trusting True Tarot. So, my beautiful Pisces, this is a daily reading for February 26, 2023. So, I'm going to say happy birthday to all of you guys who are celebrating a birthday on today. Happy, happy birthday. So, Pisces, anything you need to know is in the description box below. But we're going to jump straight into this reading, which you guys already know could be a couple of days in advance or a couple of days behind. But hopefully, you hear this message when you're intended to, and it helps and assist you in some way. All right. So, Pisces, hit that like button. Hit that like button. Thank you. I'm loving this energy that's coming out here. We have the Ace of Cups here, Pisces, in your energy. I do feel like I keep hearing all is not lost, all is not lost. So I was pulling the cards out. I heard all is not lost, all is not lost. And as I kept going, I started realizing like, oh, the message here. So this is beautiful, Pisces. I do see that you are feeling very confident and optimistic about love. I'm seeing that some of you guys are maybe even doing like um, heart chakra healing, um, I'm seeing your heart chakra opening up. Uh, this is really beautiful. I feel like I'm getting this energy where your heart, heart chakra is opening up. Um, chakras that may have been blocked, closed. Um, they're seeming like there's a lot of healing to that. So uh, you guys, heart chakra is healing. Root chakra is being healed. It's opening up. Um, sacral chakra is opening up. Third eye chakra is opening up. Crown chakra opening up. A lot of you guys are really um, healing these chakras. That's what I'm seeing. Like a lot of chakras are being healing, uh, healed here or they're opening up where there may have been some type of block energy that's being removed. Okay. So that's really beautiful. And I feel like you're feeling very confident because of that. You know, you're feeling very confident in love. You're feeling very confident with opportunities um, that are full of abundance, full of love, even maybe even in finances. I'm seeing that feeling more optimistic about these opportunities. And I just see that you're, you're, you're feeling worthy of love, worthy of the success. Um, you, some of you guys, I'm just seeing you're feeling full of love. Um, I mean, this is really beautiful. So new romantic relationships, friendships, um, family connections, your, your heart seems to be very open and filled with love as you take on this new energy. Um, that's what I'm seeing. So you guys also seem to be having this better understanding of where you are lacking, you know, and it's because of those chakras, you know, they're becoming more open, they're healed, they're now, it seems renewed, you know, they're, you're having some type of renewed energy here. And whatever is coming towards you, it, it's for some of you guys, like I said, it's that it's that understanding where you're lacking. For some of you guys, that's what you need to know. Um, but when it comes to an actual person situation, I do feel like there is someone that's coming towards you because of what you're healing, because of your chakras being healed. So whoever's coming towards you, they're becoming more spiritual and light enlightened. They're realizing there are they are not far removed from something here with you, that they are not locked out from what it is that they desire here with you, that they are not, you know, it's just like something is not out of their reach here with you. That's what you're doing. You're making someone realize that whatever it is that they desire here with you, it's not far out of their reach, out of their grasp. And that is like amazing. That's what you're doing. And you're doing this to other people or another person outside of you. <laughs> wow. Okay, so there's like energy blockages are being... I don't know, it's like energy blockages are being kind of like removed. Hmm. Out of your energy? Okay. Hmm. And I feel like you need to know this, that you need to know, because spirit is wanting me to tell you this, that negative feelings and emotions and thoughts surrounding abundance and love, finances and whatever it is, opportunity that you seek, there are a breeding ground. They're just a breeding ground for energy blockages. And so that's what creates your chakras to be blocked, your heart chakra to be blocked, your crown chakra to be blocked. It's just negative feelings, emotions and thoughts around the situations, you know, around whatever it is that you desire or seek that what that is what creates like low self-confidence and um, low self-esteem and et cetera, et cetera, you know, 
Um, so that's what I'm, I, I want you to know. But either or, Pisces, let's move away from this. Just know that um, as the advice, Spirit is saying, give yourself credit for how far you have come. Just always remember to like give yourself credit for how far you are coming along here. They're saying you're coming along very well here because um, th they're, they're, they're showing me something that it's not easy. This, this is not something easy for you. And you've came a long way is what I'm hearing. So um, in this present moment, I just really feel like Spirit is just saying, give yourself credit for how far you've come. You know, you're doing a great job. Don't be so hard on yourself. Um, <laughs> and so even in this present moment and day to day, just, just know that you're coming along just fine. You're doing good. You know, uh, there's so much that's on the horizon here for you. Your ships are coming in and good for you, Pisces. Good for you.